Okay, so you are now at home again on Friday. So I'm going to put on my hood like a Jedi mask or something, or like half you guys when you're out in the hallway trying to cover your bed head up. So anyways, here is uh, what you're doing for the day. Uh, you are going to, and I will make sure that I screen share this stuff, is you are going to work on the second part of your presentation. So, if I got this right, um, I don't need to screen share it, I think. I think it just pops up whatever's on my screen. So anyways, uh, you are going to work on the second part of your term. So you should have that first part done from yesterday, like we worked on in class. So we got done really quickly, making sure that we're not plagiarizing anything, that it's all in your own words. So, second part, second page. Let me shrink myself a little bit. There we go. It's a little bit better. Okay, so you got two parts on that second page that you need to work on. They should be done by Monday. The first thing is that you are going to, first of all, both of these things are going to be separate. Okay? They're not going to be done on this sheet. You're going to print them, preferably on the school's computer. You can do that at some point. So actually extend it past uh, Monday. Um, but you need to get this stuff printed before school, after school, during lunchtime, whatever. You got to get this thing printed. Um, so you're going to make the meme. So I will attach <clears throat> a couple pages, which you should have access at home to. They might be blocked at school, but basic meme makers, where you're going to take a picture of whatever your subject is. So you probably have to search for a Google image, and then you're going to make a meme. So the point of the meme is usually... A, we can tell what it's about. It might have something historical to it. B is supposed to be funny. So I want to see how well you can do. But do not steal somebody else's meme. It is super easy for me to tell that you stole it. Mostly because I've been doing this for years and I know which ones are already out there. So do it on your own. If you steal somebody's, I'm giving you a zero on this entire term presentation. You need to stop stealing people's work, okay? It's going to have s severe consequences when you get older in the high school and such, and even in the college if you go there. So do it yourself. So you're going to use the meme maker. It's pretty easy. Drop the picture in, follow the directions, save it, and then print it when you get back to school. And then it should be full-size paper when you do it, as big as you can, and then you're going to attach it to the sheet. Second thing, the drawing. Also done on another sheet, not on computer, but on a sheet of paper. You are drawing it. No stick figures. None, none, none. You're doing the best that you can. So this one's pretty simple. Sheet of paper, preferably side to side, east to west. Not turned up because then it gets really small. But use the whole sheet. You're going to create a drawing below. Actually below. It means on the sheet of paper. That you... in. It shows you and your term interacting. It needs to be large and in color. So what you're going to do, you're going to take a piece of paper. You're going to draw whatever your term is. So if it's monks, you're going to draw some monks, like medieval monks, not like kung fu monks. And then you will be in the picture with them. If you're doing a castle, you draw a picture of a castle, and then you're going to be somewhere in the castle. That's what I want. That's it. That's simple. You're going to do your best. I'm not drawing you on artistic ability. I'm, draw, I'm drawing you. I'm not grading you on artistic ability. I'm grading you on whether or not you follow directions and that we can tell what that is, uh, whatever your term might be. So, again, don't steal somebody else's stuff off the Internet. I don't want you tracing stuff. I don't want you copying it exactly off of the Internet. You might need to go there for visualization of what things are, but you're supposed to do it yourself. So both those sheets should be attached to... This sheet, or at least you bring them in when we finish this whole thing up. So it shouldn't take you super long on this, but, you know, might might take you more than a half hour or so. Um, so anyways, get busy on this. You guys should still owe me stuff. I'm going to make zeros in there soon. So you better get cracking on those things that you're supposed to do when you're at home. So anyways, get this stuff done. Have a good weekend. We'll see you Monday if the weather holds up.